Okay, this is a quick tutorial on how to rip a DVD movie to your hard drive from the program called WinX DVD Ripper Platinum. Uh, when you get ready to do this, the first thing is to make sure that you have your destination folder selected. You can browse to it here and tell it where you want the DVD movie to be ripped to. And then hit, make sure that your DVD movie is in the uh, DVD disc player and that Windows has recognized it. You know, it takes 20 seconds for it to find it. And then hit DVD. And then once you do that, hit OK so that it will read the disc, the movie that you're trying to rip to your hard drive. And then in this screen here, you get to choose whether you want to do a high quality or a low quality uh, DVD ripping process. The low quality is fast and the high quality is slower. So uh, just depends on what you want to do there. I like high quality, so I go that way. And then it looks at the disc, at all of the videos on the disc. And in this case, there's five. But it also knows instinctively that the 57 minute video is probably the one I want. Probably not the four second one or the 41 second one or even the three minute or six minute one down there. If you want all of them, of course, you can click on each one of these title boxes and check them off for what uh, so that it will rip those. But if you're like me and all you want is the movie, then hit run. Once you hit run, it's going to start ripping the DVD to this folder right here. And then once it's done, you'll hit the OK button. And in my case, it opens up automatically to the folder where it saves it. I think there's a checkbox to tell it to do that, uh, although I don't see it here on this screen. So I think it's on another screen when you begin the process. So um, keep that in mind. If, if your folder doesn't open automatically, there's probably a checkbox you need to check. And I'm not offhandedly able to tell you where that is. But anyway, this is going to get your movie from the disk to your hard drive and you'll be set.